Hey guys, what's up our amazing people? How are you all doing? I hope you all are doing so well. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are. I hope you are amazing. And if it's your first time here, hello, my name is Irene and welcome to my channel. Yeah, I share health and spiritual tips. If that's what you like, please do well to hit that subscribe button. Make sure you turn on the notification so you'll be notified whenever there's a new upload from me. Today's video, we're talking four things you shouldn't talk like, four things you should keep secret. You should not talk, 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 okay? Not everything you talk sometimes, keep your mouth, okay? Yeah. Um, before we go into the video, for those of you that have been wanting to buy my product because of the price you've not been able to purchase, well, I am happy. I am glad to announce to you, my darling. There we are on sales and the sales is starting on the 28th of August. I did a video, um, the video should be up by now, so make sure you go to my uh, to my videos. The video before this video is a video and watch where I talked about the products that will be on, um, on sales, yeah? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so let's get right into the video. Uh, like I said, we're talking four things you, sh you should keep private. Not everything you talk, 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 talk. Some of you, that is the cause of your problem. You talk too much. Okay, sometimes learn to keep your mouth shut. Some of you, even if you are doing spiritual work, you will talk. You will still talk. Maybe somebody will say, come and do this. They say, no, I cannot do it too. I'm doing spiritual work. I'm praying. I did do pray. I know if you do. And maybe later, why? Who send you? Why should you talk? Not everything you talk. Okay, yeah. So the first one on my list will have to be your dreams. Not everyone you tell your dream. Mm -hmm. Some of you are fond of doing this thing. Whenever you dream and you're confused, you must ask, oh, I'm looking for somebody to interpret. Who will interpret this dream for me? No, not everybody. Don't tell. But you, when it comes to dream, you have to look for someone that is honest, reliable, sincere. Because some people might take your luck through your dreams. Because dreams are one way you know what is going to happen to you in future. Okay? Yeah. So some people, when you tell them your dream, and maybe that dream is directing you towards your future. They'll be like, ah, this person has a very bright future. They'll take away your future. They'll take away your, your luck. They'll take away your glory. Okay? So for dreams, be careful who you share your dreams with. For me, I would say there's no need. Okay? Just keep your dreams to yourself. That's one good thing about practicing spirituality. If you're the type that's always doing spiritual work, that practice spirituality, when you dream, if you don't understand, and you are into spirituality, you will dream about it again. You will keep having that same dream and it will be coming clearer and clearer and clearer. That's one of the benefits of always doing spiritual work, okay? But if you are you, the person that doesn't like to or you are too lazy or is not just a belief, please do not just tell somebody your dream. Just, you know, keep it to yourself. Or second one on my list is your goal, okay? Do not tell people what you are doing. Do not tell people what you want to do next year, what you want to do next two years, next three years. Just keep it to yourself, okay? Like I said, not everything you talk, okay? Even people very, very close to you, do not tell them. Just do. Just surprise them, yeah? Believe it or not, my darling, people don't like to hear good news. People do not like to hear when you want to do something. Why for some other people, when you tell them you're good, they will go ahead and do it. <laughs> they'll even do it better than you and you'll be like ah, ah but i was the one with this idea now why <clears throat> they don't care so that's why you need to keep it to yourself like surprise them shock them when you come out of like wow i wasn't expecting this yeah always shock them it is very very important and the third one on my list will be your income for no reason even husband and wife <laughs> I say this a lot. As I people like, <laughs> do not allow anybody to know your words, how much you have in your account. Okay. Some people will say, no, if you love your husband, tell him. Your husband should tell you how much you have. Your wife should tell you. Blah, blah. For me, right from time, I don't, don't know how much I have. I don't want to know how much you have. Okay. Keep it to yourself. I'll keep mine to myself. That's because when people know your words, when they know what you have, when they know your account balance, they will bill you according to your account balance. And once you say no, you become a bad person. You're like, ah, she has money and she doesn't want to give. So that's why you shouldn't let anyone know your income. Because when they know your income, they will want to pull you down. Even when it comes to marriage, relationship, is the same thing. I'm not going to lie. When your spouse knows that you have a lot of money, 
it's going to give you bill according to your money. He will not even want to spend his own money because he knows that you have money. So always make him understand that, guy, there's no money. I don't have money. I'm just managing. Like, aside marriage, even other people, let them know you are managing. How are you doing? How is business? I am managing. People like to hear that you are managing. If you tell them that you are doing well, hmm. Okay, they'll be giving you bill, 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 bill till they wreck you. That's when they will rest. That's why some of some people, because of um, family problems and all that, because people, their family people know their salary, what they earn every month, or what they make from their business every day or every month. That's the reason why they'll be giving them billing, strong billing. So if you are not wise, they will just drain you. And at the end of the day, you will not be able to give account for what you've done so far with your money be like how come how did i spend this money i've been working for so so years i've been making money what did i use my money for a lot of you are sitting on this table and you need to be smart about it to be very honest okay i think this is the third one and the last one will be your love life some people if their husband give them or their boyfriend give them Two hundred thousand. They'll tell. They'll tell their friend, their family. They'll sing it. Hey, help me to thank my husband. No, he gave me hundred thousand. He gave me two hundred thousand to go for shopping. No. <laughs> hey, see if you are doing this, stop it. It will not favor you. My husband is always taking care of me. We go clubbing every weekend. He buys me whatever I want. That man is God sent. I'm so lucky that. <laughs> hey, people of this world. Hmm. They don't like such news. They will just collect the man from your hand or they'll go and do something and the man will start misbehaving. Yeah. Some of you, the reason why your husband is misbehaving today is because you cannot keep quiet. You refuse to shut your mouth. That's why your husband change. Okay? So not every time you tell people what your husband has done, your husband loves you so much, and we cannot do without you. Not every time, not everything your husband do, you will tell people, okay? Keep it secret. Let it just be. I know this social media life, we like to pepper them and all that, but sometimes it's not necessary. That's not all. Sometimes, um, this is common among young girls, when your man D is good, that is, he can give you well, he's very good in bed. You start saying it, you start telling your friends, Oh, that's my guy, he's so good. He can, mm, mm, hey, the guy can stop, the guy can do this, he can satisfy me, he can go five, six, seven rounds. Hey, <laughs> you start telling your friend, Oh man, that guy is fire. My sister, <laughs> don't smash him, don't collect him from you. Mm, yes, the collecting. Mm. I know of someone, two friends, two good friends. So the other friend went to sleep with the other friend. This one is even um, two married women, not even young girls, two married women. The other one went to sleep with the other one husband because of this same, my husband D is big, very strong. He gives it to me. They, uh, they lick everywhere because of this kind of talk. That other married one, go sleep with the other one husband. So, my dear, <laughs> stop it. Keep your mouth shut. Not everything you <laughs> sometimes keep a secret. And I'm going to add this to it, which is going to make it, I think, number five. Keep other people secret, secret. Okay. When I come to you and tell you something in confidence, do not go about telling other people, okay? <laughs> some of you that's the reason why things are not going well for you because some people once they tell you secret and you now enter and tell another person they can kill you they can just frustrate your life they can send you sickness so be very very careful if i tell you something in confidence do not tell somebody else i keep it secret i'm going to see you all in my next one i hope you learn anything or so in today's video do take care of yourself and stay healthy